point of time where you all thought that the game was going away from you? Um, I think the entire time that the situations probably dictated how the game was unfolding. I mean, they were going hard up front to try and qualify within that 29 over, so we knew there was an opportunity for us to grab wickets, which we did. And obviously, when they stopped doing that, we knew now it's time that we need to now take three wickets or two wickets at that particular time, uh, which is always going to be tough because they only had to score like two, three runs and over. So we had to be a bit more creative and be patient. So it was a fascinating game of cricket purely because of the situations um, that where Australia was and where we were. Um, Mahela, you reached uh, 11,000 ODA runs today. So what was the feeling like uh, at reaching another milestone? Well, obviously, in, in that situation in the middle, I didn't feel anything obviously pleased uh, when that numbers came up. But um, obviously, I can tonight probably reflect more on that achievement because um, we won the game as well. So importantly, the contribution that I made towards the team is much more valuable for me. But uh, quietly, I should be able to reflect on that achievement. Um, how much input do you give uh, Angelo from a captain seat perspective and tactically at this point still? Um, I, I try not to do too much, let him uh, you know, uh, make a lot of calls. But you know, try and help him out in tough situations when when I feel that if he's you know um, out of sorts or something, because it's important that uh, that's his team now, and and for him to make mistakes sometimes or make good calls, uh, le learn while on the job. So try and help him as much as possible in tough situations. Just few ideas here and there, but uh, I think so far in this tournament we had some really tough games, and I thought Angie's handled himself really really well. So. Our job is to try and help him as much as possible. Looking forward to the semis. You've already played India once in the warm. What, is, what are the key areas, or what is the key to counter there? Um, I think you know they're, they're they're playing some really good cricket, and um, uh, the batting looks really strong. So uh, those are key areas that we need to focus a bit on. But it's a semi-final, um, warm-up games or whatever. It doesn't count right now. It's a big tournament. It's a semi-final. So looking forward to that. Mahila, uh, you've lost two World Cup finals, uh, shared a Champions Trophy final with India. Uh, you, you're not sure if you'll be around in 2015. How desperate does this make you to, to uh, get it right this time? I don't know. I mean, you could see how desperate I was today. So I'll be desperate for every game to win. Simple as that. It's not about big trophies or whatever, just to win matches. So I'll have that same passion. I'll have that desperation to win games. Uh, it doesn't matter whether it's a semi-final, a final, or just a group game. As long as I have that attitude and the rest of the boys, you know, we'll go a long way. Uh, Mahela, what were your sort of issues with Matt Wade out there? Um, nothing much, you know, just a little bit of banter, obviously. Um, um, it's all, all good. Um, shook hands after the game. Um, obviously, he said something about the way I was batting the last few overs. Um, so I just uh, told him, don't worry, you know, there is obviously a plan. and. Um, You'll see once we finish the game, so obviously I probably have the last laugh.